Hello everyone, White Mage Serenia here, welcome me back to Let's Play the Gaia 2 Dual Saga Bonus 3. In between videos, I did some equipment grinding here and there. Well, just some brief equipment grinding. I needed something with anti-stun. And just on a whim, I decided to redo the championship match. And I ran into Vixen. Vixen the something. I forget his uh, thing. So I'm just going to go Sky Fang. I mean, uh, yeah, Sleeping Dragon Double Divine Bolt. I believe, yeah, Vixen the Great. If you manage to beat him, I do believe that uh, it'll change the statue or the, or the cardboard cutout in the, in the main lobby. This is really entertaining. But as you can see, he's got a bit of health to him. So he's no pushover by any stretch of the imagination. Now, in the dream match, when I, because I'm gonna, that's what I'll be doing after this, right quick. But during the dream match, it's actually possible to encounter all three of these knights, Balkan, uh, Raynoff, and Vixen at the same time. Although that's what I kind of like about old school arenas like that, because you can still fight characters alive or dead. It's kind of amusing. All right, I won. I did it. All right, now let's see what happens after I beat Vixen here. I think it's random when you actually encounter him, because I encountered Steel on another playthrough. Or not a playthrough, but another attempt. But, uh, because I, I did the championship match a couple of times, just for, you know. Just for the last, because I, I was actually, yeah, see, I was actually rendering at the time. And it's not possible. I demand a rematch. But yeah, um, now, this is what I grinded for. And actually, what I did was I got a Valor Ring and leveled it up, so I, could, so I got the anti-stun from Valor Ring, but I did not want the hit down. So I was just seeing what I could do, and then I came across, if you combine that uh, Valor Ring with a bonus bangle, you get the armor bangle with anti-stun. So then I went and leveled that, that up, and that seems like a pretty damn solid piece of equipment to me. And it has no negatives, and it has the anti-stun that I wanted. In fact, as you can see here, it's pretty nifty. And everyone else, you know, they've got decent stuff. I took off his, you know, his best boots for a reason. And, yeah. So, look, uh, this is what I have right here. I have the tireless ribbon for, you know, all that, of course. Then I have this for the anti-stun. This for the charge heal. Because, effectively, though, you want those traits when you go into the dream match. Because they help a lot. Because even at level 99, this is not really easy, per se. I mean, it can be, but not really. And we're going to let Andrew go for it. Alright, here we go. Oh, wow. <laughs> right off the bat, it's Maya. Oh, well. Sorry, Maya. Here we go. Don't worry, Maya. When your turn comes around, you'll have plenty of opportunity to take on Lang. Sorry, Maya. No hard feelings. Hey, you okay? Sorry, Maya. Didn't mean to beat you up too bad. It is wild that you can fight your own teammates in this thing. Now, the dream match actually is a lot longer than the other arena fights because instead of eight rounds, there's like ten, I think. Oh, hey there, master. <laughs> you don't have your charge heal this time. You're mine. Well, after you attack first for some reason, even though my agility is much higher than yours. But alright, I'll let it slide, because you don't mean crap to me right now. Here we go. My turn. This is how it's done. There's always one problematic team member when you fight these things, because in my best file, it's freaking Sharon. But it makes sense, because her agility is super high. You will never outspeed her, so I guess Kazan just keeps rolling natural 20s or something. Seriously, that's the only way he can outspeed Lang, considering his agility's lower. Wait, charge heal is triggered? But you don't have charge heal? 
Oh, don't tell me multiple pieces of his equipment have charge heal. Oh, that would really cheese me off. Well, I thought his HP was low enough to use his Mystic Art. Because Kazan really should not have had charge heal unless another piece of his equipment gives it to him. Alright, Kazan, you know what? You've really upset me. I'm sorry to do this to you, Master, but you deserve it. Wow, that's barely doing damage to him. Wow. That was impressive defense. Something, Master. Oh well. Hey, you kind of ticked me off. What can I say? What can I do about that? I seriously don't know why he had charge heal, though. I'm pretty sure he only gets, like... I don't know. That was just strange. I'll check his equipment again, uh, a little bit later. Ooh, sorry, Sharon. I know I can be at the team at times, so I'm sorry. I need titles. Besides, you'll be okay. Just take two pain pills and call me in the morning. Indeed. Sorry. Did I overdo it? Yeah, you killed her. She's dead. You cut her. You know, you cut her body in plain and all that other nice stuff. Yep. You killed her. You're a murderer laying and all that other stuff. As I said, all three of them at once. You thought I was joking. <laughs> but I wasn't. Let's see if I can deal enough damage to take out at least Balkan or something with this. Hit them all three at once. Rawr. Ugh, final burst! Falcon and Raynoff really aren't the problem. It's, uh, Vixen that is and all this. Just because he can hit pretty dang hard. And can attack multiple times, as you can see. Because he's, like, beefed up from his previous version. Oh, hi. Yep, but of course, Balkan would be juiced up a little bit. <laughs> I fully healed every ounce of that damage he just did to me. But that was hilarious. Let's try this out. Didn't get the show in. Another reason this can take so damn long too, because all the others are just one on one. This one actually can have you fighting multiple enemies at once. Oh God! Oh. Let's try this again. Final burst. Three of them down at once. That was tough. Yeah, it was, Lang, but you did it, buddy. You and Galia. 
Yes, I am ready. Who we got next? <laughs> Sweet Tooth Congo! I will banish you to the Shadow Realm. Water! Water! Kind of amusing, though, that the Hyper Arts do more than the Mystic Arts to your allies. Kind of crazy. I'll show you. Then again, they have higher defense of than just like normal monsters, I do believe. But look at that. He's definitely stronger. <laughs> Alright, so who's coming out to play next? Ah, Rouse! This ought to be fun. I'm gonna do Double Sleeping Dragon to a Red Whirlwind. Yeah. Woo. What's up? As that I give my entire life to this blade. Blade of destruction, do your bidding. Take this destruction. Love that. He spams the hell out of it in the arena, though. But it's no matter. I'll show you. I'll show you. Hey. Zappity zappity donkey. Hit. Sand. Storm. Ha <laughs> I give my entire life to this blade. Blade of destruction. Do your bidding. Take this. All you got? Sleeping Dragon, Divine Bolt, Divine Bolt. Hear me, oh Mystic Blade! Fire your laser of doom! Yes, you will, Wang. Do it again! I'll watch you! You little. I give my entire life to this blade. Blade, blade of destruction. Do your bidding. Take the blade destruction. With the symphony of destruction. You love it. Oh, you. <laughs> now you guys probably. This is starting to get real boring. This is the path I choose. Well, I'm glad you choose that path, Lang. Langy boy. Clever Langy boy. Gonna be rocky, ain't ya? Because you knew you can't hang with the big boys. Or maybe you can. Maybe the big boys can't hang with you. Humans love a fighting. I really hope I didn't forget to equip full. I forgot to equip full power. That's alright. 
I didn't need that anyway. Ow, 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 ow. That does hurt a lot. Oof. No cool. We can take out her first. Sleeping. She dies pretty easily, as you might have guessed. The big problem is going to be Vestra, though, just like before. survived. How about that? That's true. But at least I can use my Mystic Art here in a bit. Bop, 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 bop. Especially if he keeps that up. <laughs> Still, though, I think you have to take her out first, otherwise you can't kill Vestra. As I recall, that is. If you take out Vest or something, Velma just revives it or something. Can't fully remember. What the? Ah. I don't think this one hits that hard. Let's hope not, anyway. Otherwise, I might have to use a healing item. Oh no, she was just locking on to me. She wasted her turn. Alright. I'll take that. <sighs> She'd have already been toasted if I didn't forget to equip full power. Always check your skills. But at least I still have my max AP. I would have been boned without that at least. Wow, you're still not down yet, lady? Uh -oh. This might hurt. Oh, thank you, Charge Heal. Otherwise, that would have left me with like one HP, I would think. Oh my lord. You're mine, Velma. 400 or 4,998. God for charge heal. I'll show you. That's why it's a good idea to pack it. Now it's just you and me, Velma. Or Vespa. Vespa? Um, what's your name? Oh, Vestra. That's right. I think this guy blocks half damage, I think. Half all normal damage. This is where freaking full power would have came in handy, but you know, just I'll be able to blast him away with a Mystic Art. I think this guy also takes like no damage from special attacks, so. I might try an origin attack on him here in a bit. I don't know. It would make sense for him to be immune to that, though. Uh... Oh, wait a minute. I know what I can do. Yeah, go ahead and hit me with Acolyte Fist, dude. Go ahead. Yeah, let's try this. That'll increase my strength. Which means I should effectively be able to dish out more damage, naturally. Ha! Ah. It increases. Yeesh. I don't know by how much, though, or for how long. Oh. Hey, but at least this thing can't really hurt me that bad. Not without Velma. I just keep healing all the damage that it does to me. It's like, tch, damage? What damage? Sleeping. 
Yeah, that seems ineffectual still. Actually, seems like it did less damage. Like, I don't even know if that's possible. Well, let's try this out. Because this is gonna take forever if I'm only gonna do 5,000 damage a hit. I mean, a turn, because I need to do more. Cause this thing's probably got like 100 some thousand HP or something. I don't know. Ah, there we go. Yeah. That's what I've been. That's what I should have been using this entire time. Oh well. Oh. Can't believe I freaking forgot to equip full power. gonna make this take a lot longer than it needs to. So much so, I'm almost tempted to freaking pass and then edit back up to this point. Because it's random up until you start getting to the boss characters like Rouse. The last few are always the same. So that's a bit unfortunate, but we should be fine. Especially if they get me low enough to be able to use my Mystic Art. We really... One... That's when we'll really, like, be cooking with gas. Alright, this one should be... Is it who I think it is? If it is... This is yep. the power that creates new worlds. Hi, Avalon. That pretty much means we're near the end. Because once it's after him, it's the final. Oh god, I better give myself some mana. Uh, there we go. Magic bottle. That'll do. It's the sound of life ebbing away. If he knocks me, let's see how much damage he'll do to me. Watch out! You guys remember this one, don't you? He will spam this. This you literally. Will this with regret. You will back on this with regret. <gasps> oh god. Uh. That just killed me, didn't it? Yep. The sound of light ebbing away. Yeah, yeah, this is why you want to have charge heal. And inventability pills. Don't know why he was able to hit me that hard. That was ridiculous. Alright, anyway, where is my invincibility pills? There they are. Here we go. Now you gotta kinda watch, you know, watch your stats there because you don't know when it's gonna wear off. As I said, he's gonna constantly spam this. Sound of nothing ebbing away. Let's try this for size. Because Avalon can take a lot of damage. This is gonna take a while. Ugh. Steel's even worse because he's got 1.4 million HP, and without my full power trick, I'm not gonna be able to do that much damage to him, so that might take a few. Quite a while, too. Thankfully, though, Steel won't be able to hit me as hard as Avalon does. You will look back on this with regret. And with anti stun, I should be okay. Which means I should be able to get an invincibility pill off. But, like, I don't know. I might test the water a little bit before I use an invincibility pill and just guard to see if Steel's gonna be faster than me. Because if he is, 
then that's going to be a problem. But if he isn't, then I can set up something and might be able to just spam the hell out of my Mystic Arch. In which case, that will help me take him down a lot faster. But again, without full power, that's going to suck. Because full power is usually integral for that. It's possible, Avalon, believe me. You will look back on this with regret. <laughs> Yet again, you do nothing. Sound of life ebbing away. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> The invincibility pill wore off. So, use another one. That's the way it usually goes. And of course, he's gonna do that. You will look back, back on this with regret. <laughs> Bam! Boom! Blam! cool if the invincibility pill also allowed you to use your mystic art, because, like, I don't know. That'd be cool. Boing, boing, bam! Oh, well, Divine Bolt actually hits pretty damn hard. So that's something cool. Ah! Stay down! Oh. Yeah, yeah. I find it funny, though, that this Avalon's actually more powerful than the final boss Avalon. And I'm like, shouldn't this have been the final boss version? <laughs> oh, well. It's fine. It's just, I, I, I find it really amusing sometimes. And oh my lord, it's all because I forgot to equip full power that this is taking near as long as it does. I should have been done by now. And he's not down yet either, is he? Uh oh. He's almost down, though. You will look back on this with regret. Boing! Boing! Boing. Bah. <laughs> like, I don't even care, dude. Sound of light ebbing away. Don't care. Oh my god, did my invincibility pill wear off? off? No! Oh. Damn it. I don't want to waste another invincibility pill. No one might look, he's like one turn away. Oh. Fine. Better safe than sorry, and it's not like I can't easily make these things. It's extremely easy, by the way. All you need to do is go to Tanza, buy the sword Quantum Biel, and then trade that in Jenga for the uh, unassailable pills. And then just craft those into invincibility pills using, uh, what the hell is it? Like, Zonark Weed and, uh, Don, Donzu Potion, something like that, which are easily got through the secret shop. So if you have access to the secret shop, you're good. You can make an infinite number of in invincibility pills if you really want to. Now, let's see if I was right. Come on, Avalon. And get to showing him, Lang. We need a win. I'll show you. We need to win. 
Oh, well, it's a good thing I did use my pill. You will look back on this with regret. Are you sure you're not the one that's gonna be regretting? Oh god, my invincibility pill wore off that fast. That was only like one turn. Oh god, please let this be the last turn for him. Oh god. Oh god! That only lasted one turn, dude. The sound of you have no idea how annoying that is. Oh my god. Pathetic. Victory comes to the one who has more to lose. There you go. Level 99 does not guarantee you win. Alright guys, we're back. Alright, so with full power equipped, we should be able to handle ourselves a little bit differently. But, I kinda wanna test the waters here. I wanna see if guarding will still allow him to kick my ass in one freaking hyper arch. If so, invincibility pill spam. But if not, and I survive with a little bit of HP, I should be able to freaking... Oh good, it does reduce the damage, but will it be enough? Because, um, if it leaves me with just enough to spam my Mystic and I can full power that, then I'll be good. Alright, I barely survived it. That's good. That means, that means Avalon, your ass is mine, bro. Because now, this is going to be fun. Provided, of course, my pill doesn't last like one turn like it did last time. Oh, that annoyed the crap out of me. Yeah, I'm sure I won't. Ugh. Ugh. Now I need. Hopefully, my uh, full power will still last since I didn't really attack yet. But knowing my luck, it won't. I'll have to use defense again. But if I do, that's the fine. Sound of away. The sound of your wife stepping away. Wait, what? All right. So let's see. Yeah. See, I have to do it again. Alright, but I do want my full power applied to my Mystic Guard. There's a reason. You will look back on this with regret. Yeah, yeah. Blast. And since my charge heal's still up, I think even if my invincibility peel does wear off, I'm gonna use my Mystic Guard right here and right now. Because at full power, that thing should do plenty to Avalon. Check it! Wah! Yeah! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh, bam! 600,000 damage, dude. Not enough, though. Back on this with regret. You will look back on this with regret. You will look back on this with regret. <laughs> totally something straight out of DBZ. Kamehameha! The sound of light ebbing away. You know, I honestly wouldn't be surprised if Avalon was inspired by a DBZ character. Would not be surprised even in the slightest. Oh, 
Boom! Come on. You'll Good. never know how this feels. Alright, now we've gotta deal with uh Oh boy. You look Steel. pretty strong. Okay, how's my HP looking? I know my MP needs a bit of a tune-up. I'm gonna take my chances. Magic bottle. Oh god, he's faster than me. There's my mana, my magic back at least. Uh, but yeah, with no double attack and stun guard or anti-stun, I don't have to worry about this because he can he can stun me, but he can't really do that much damage to me. All right, so. On guard. That was nothing. Well, that was a waste of a waste of a turn, but that's okay. At least I can spam my. Uh, Mystic Art, a little bit. Remember though, this guy's got 1.4 million HP. Yeah, I should be able to use it. I, just, I hope I get to use my Mystic Art. That's gonna irk me if I can. But I'm below half health, so... Still a little bit below half health. Oh look! My Invincibility Potion wore off instantly. Oh, of course. Freaking invincibility pill. Don't wear off like that, you asshole. Now I can't access my strongest arsenal. Ugh. But, at the very least, I do have my, uh... See that block status change? That he was trying to stun me. See? He was trying to stun me again. I'm good, I'm still invincible. Thank you. My turn! Hope this does a plenty plenty enough damage. He's got 1.4 million HP. So we gotta remember that one. But we can still chunk him even without our Mystic Arts. Only problem is, my charge heal's already down, so... We gotta really keep an eye on our invincibility status. Okay, we're still good. That cutting edge is really strong. I don't like it. Really, invincibility? You're gonna wear off like that right there. Really? You know what? Screw it. No, 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 no. I can't take chances. <sighs> I don't know why I'm getting such crap luck with these invincibility pills, dude. I suppose I should I could attack every round and you get the most out of my invincibility, but it's not always a good idea to fight like that. It's alright though, it should be fine. 
We took a little over. There should be like 900 health left at the moment, so. Sorry if this one's a little bit longer, by the way, guys. I just wanted to have each one of these bonus episodes dedicated to the entire run of the, of the tournament. And I didn't want to just be like, oh, well, I failed. Here's another bonus episode, you know. Oof. Am I still invincible? Hell yeah, I am. Blade of Fury! But check it out. Look how many times I would have been stunned otherwise without anti stun or my uh, invincibility pills. It's kind of insane! I will show you. Divine Bolt! Uh, Raging Fang! He's around half health now, and I'm still invincible, so let's guard it up. Blade of Fury! I hope I'm still gonna be invincible at the end of this turn. I am, sweet. I'm getting lucky on that one. Hoah! And Blade! Yeah! Bam! Huh. Raging Fang! Oh, and there! Blade of Fury! Am I still invincible? Oh, yes, I am. Yeah, guard it. Oh. Please still be invincible at the end of this. Sweet. And. All those pills he's been popping for this. Yeah, huh? But that's how it happens sometimes. Oh. Uh. Okay, yeah. This is how we roll. Wow. Yeah, he won't be taken down for a little while, but I guarantee he's got just a couple turns left. Faded. I'm taking my chances though. I know he's low enough at this point. Come on. Huh. I, hate, I hate it when I only get just one turn on that on those pills, dude. So stupid. Considering it says several turns, not just one roll turn. And he gets back up. Wonderful. No double attack, though. Oh, good. Just play the Fury. Pop another pill. Ah. 
<laughs> Sorry, Steel. Not gonna work that way. Uh, wait, how many? Yeah, I need to on it! What the? There we go. <laughs> Three, six, nine, nine. Oh, now. Cutting edge! Fun. What? Really? Invincibility pill. Stop it with your crap. Stop wearing off instantly. And he gets back up. Wonderful. Oh god. Ugh. No! Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh thank god. Close call. Now, Lang, don't you dare let your invisibility potion wear off at the end of this turn. You better last. Because I don't want to risk death here. Oh, thank you, God. I believe it is over, Steel. Fall! match winner? To think that anyone would triumph! I doubt even my own eyes! You are no longer a mere mortal! You are a conqueror of the world! True conqueror! That is perfect for you! Here, claim your prizes! Whew. Heaven's Secret. Stab and slice! I've never seen anything like it! How about Flying Dragon as a fighting name? Yay! That means you only need to get Star Destroyer now. Which, to get Star Destroyer, all you need to do is just keep using, uh... What you call it? Um, Sleeping Dragon. So what I'm gonna do... Is in between episodes here... Because I've got, I've got one more bonus episode I want to share with you guys. Just one more. I'm gonna go get that title. Because I need it. Until then, guys, sorry this episode went on for so long. Um... I didn't intend for it to, but that, I told you, the dream match can be a bit of a bitch. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. This has been White Mage Serenia, signing off. Tune in next time, guys, for the epic finale of Let's Play Legend of Legaia 2 Dual Saga.